tell you why going to JMU was the right move for college game day. I know we've all been sitting here saying that Corvallis was robbed as we see two top schools go at it this weekend. Let me explain to you why JMU was not a wrong place to go to. So there are 133 Vision One football programs. And as someone who's been to many games that are Power Five and Group of Five, you get absolute wonderful experiences and all of them are very unique. So then when you go to a place like JMU, rather than say like in Alabama, where one school hasn't got it much and the other school gets it all the time, you get crowds like this. And no, this isn't Saturday hours before the game. This was Friday on the Pat McAfee show. And I have seen that Pat McAfee show on Fridays and the crowd usually looks pretty limited compared to the Saturday crowd. But I can tell you all these fans don't care about a lick of school this week. You have fans not caring what they chant. And they kept continuously chanting, talk your shit. Also, you might want to think that ESPN and the college game day crew wanted to potentially give light to JMU and maybe give them a shot to go bowling. You might think they wouldn't ever do that. Well, you have this goat on here who kept saying and got the crowd to chant F the NCAA. And to be honest, I've never seen more trash talk from a person to the NCAA. It's literally saying that the people in those office buildings do not have brains. And that is quote for quote. So I think we need a relish. These small schools getting college game day. Because unlike Bama, who is conditioned to it, these guys get up for this. And make the college game day experience one to remember forever.